use your phone abroad at no extra cost in 18 destinations. Kiss breakfast. So it's Charlie Hedges right now. I am joined by the lovely, the beautiful Ariana Grande. Thank how are you. you. I'm good. How are you? Good. Thank you. So uh, let's get straight into the single, Dangerous okay. Woman. Yes. Loving the single. Thank you. How does it feel to be back in the UK with some new music? It's very exciting. I got to see my fans. I got to be kissed and hugged and squeezed, and I'm very happy about it. I love the weather. I'm very happy to be here seeing my friends and promoting the new song. It's my favorite single that I've ever put out, so it means a lot. Favorite ever? Yeah. Wow. By far, actually. Okay. Yes, I'm very, very happy. Now, the album title went from Moonlight. Moonlight to Dangerous Woman. So how comes the last minute change out of interest? Um, Moonlight is still a very important song on the album and one of the most special songs, I think. But um, I feel like the whole body of work is more accurately represented by the title Dangerous Woman because, okay. you know, Moonlight is a sweeter kind of love song and I feel like it belongs in what I used to do, yeah. you know? And that's great. I'm glad that that element is still a part of the album, but this is such a more mature and dark, kind of sexier, pop, urban mix that, I don't know, I just feel like this title more accurately represented the the work in its entirety. Now, we just recently found out that Nicki Minaj is yes. confirmed. Oh my I'm God. I'm so excited, yeah. So that is definitely. I love her so much. Well, I was going to say, that is one dangerous woman. Hell yeah, she is the epitome of a dangerous woman. Are there any other females on the album that you can confirm? No, there are some boys though. I worked with Lil Wayne, he was amazing. I got to work with Future, who is Wicked. amazing. Yeah, and um, Macy Gray. Yeah, no way. she's a dangerous woman as well. Go on, Macy. I've yes. had that name for a while. Yeah, she killed it. She's incredible. April Fool's Day. It's coming up Yeah, when we prank everybody. I'm the worst. As in, you get involved or you don't? Either way. I'm just, it's not a holiday that I go all out <laughs> for. And I feel like I'm either so gullible and I'm just like <laughs> the person to go to to prank. <laughs> but then I'd, I've never really done a prank with someone else in April. I've, I'm just like, is this really a holiday? <laughs> I'm so tired, you know? Just stay at home. Do I really have to like commit to like, making someone fall for something right now. <laughs> I want to ask you if this was a prank. You unfollowed Justin Bieber over the weekend. What I happened didn't. with that? I actually didn't. I think it was like a glitch or something. But you both, I did it. It both did it at the same time. Yeah, that's why I think it was a glitch. I, nothing happened. I wish there was something more exciting or dramatic to report. But there's Unfortunately, not. I'm a very, very boring person to interview. There's nothing exciting. And I the am. same for Instagram as well, because apparently it did it on both. No, I did. I mean, maybe he blocked me or something. <laughs> I don't know what I did. No, no there's nothing going on. Okay. There's nothing that's to good. report. That and we haven't good. spoken in months. He's a great guy. He's a great artist. We have a nice friendship. There's nothing going on. Now, I need to talk about the bunny outfit in your yeah. acapella. Right. Girl uh, on girl. How the heck did you get into that outfit? Uh, lube. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> no, like full on. Not like latex lube. Like lube lube. It was really okay. interesting. And how long did it take to get out of it? A couple minutes. It took a couple, you know, Delina and Brigitte were squeezing me and, you know, sliding me around. And it was, it was not as glamorous as one would <laughs> think. Looked, okay. Yeah. Uh, Saturday Night Live, your yeah. impressions on that show. Wow. For Thank me, you. I think Shakira. That's my favorite one. Was it yours? Yeah, I think so. Unreal. But Thank you. I would like to know if you can do an Adele. Have you tried? I've never tried it. But it's a good one, right, to try? Yeah, she's amazing. We'll give you that one to We're practice good. at home. Yeah. <laughs> um, UK tour, when are we going to get you back in the UK for a tour? I haven't announced any tour dates thus far, but I'm excited. Tour was the most fun that I've ever had. I've only done one. It was a honeymoon tour. Um, or one, uh, like, I guess, that felt like a real one. But, um, yeah, and uh, it was great so when I find out when I'm coming here I'll let you know and last question what's in your jacket I'm selling watches <laughs> but I can't show you they're they're in here I'll get some no it was, it was a fashion choice but I realized when I sat down I look like I might be a bad guy we love it we love the jacket um, like what am I smuggling in here? <laughs> Ariana thank you so Kale. much again for joining us it's been thank an absolute you for pleasure. having me good luck with the single and the album thank you so much Ariana Grande Justin and I have been waiting for the right song to do for such a long time we've been waiting for like the right thing so for right now i think the what do you mean remix is a nice way to start but in the future maybe something else will come along that we can do too nice.